Aha! Hello, my hearties. Dinky do. It's just me, Scotty McClue. Thought I'd do a quick pop up just to see how you all are. Welcome, 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 I say. Lovely to have you with us. Thank you, Davil, for joining us. As soon as you join us, of course, please do follow. Always lovely to have you with us. And uh, the time just gone, half past 11 on Monday evening. So I thought uh, we'll just see what's happening. Uh, I like to base it on uh, Crocodile Dundee. You know, remember he had the just saying who's about, all that sort of stuff. Scotty McClue, hashtag flow tie, first lord of the internet, just for you, saying dinky do. So tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 that Scotty's live on TikTok. And welcome, welcome, welcome. So lovely to have you with us. And always a great chat. Thank you very much. Now then, that's not a knife. This is a knife. That's it, Charles Clark, you get it. Brilliant, fantastic, clever, clever, clever man. There we go. Uh, tell 10, tell 10, tell 10 that we are here, guys. Hello, dinky-doo, what's your tartan? My tartan is a beautiful tartan. I'll show you a picture. In fact, you might see it on some of the TikTok videos. Guys, can you follow me as soon as you come on? Clarky, thank you very, very much for the follow. Very, very important. We want to get these follows right up big style. So as soon as you come on, click, click, follow, follow, and away we go. English to the bone. Are you chewy? Well done, sir. I'm Scottish to the bone. There we are. What's the time, Scotty? In the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland, it's 28 minutes to midnight. How about that, I say to you. Follow us as soon as you go on, guys. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome to our late night live pop-up from me, Scotty McClue. Thank you, Duvid, for following. Very, very important. If everybody can follow now, guys, can you see the TikTok videos from where you are? So there you go. Now then, Sparky, you'll be better checking with your GP. Uh, did you check for that, Scotty? Oh, Charles, I know all these things. I don't have to check that sort of stuff. I can tell you that's what it's about. McClure has the facts at his fingertips. Who's the person in the pictures? That's just me. Well, there's Lord Reith, the Labrador. These were all presented to me. Fantastic. How do, Mr. McClure? Peter, how lovely to have you with us. Hello from Thurzo. We love you in Thurzo. Yes, my uncle went to Thurzo to build the roads for Dunre. What about that? Um, lots and lots of you joining us. This is absolutely beautiful. Thank you very much. Fantastic. We never, ever scroll. We never, ever troll. Okay, says Lewis. Dinky you know. Thoughts on the Ford Capri? I loved the Ford Capri. It actually was the vehicle of the DJ at one time. If you had a Ford Capri and you could get them from 1300 upwards, the 1300 wouldn't really have pulled the skin off a rice pudding, but uh, the others were outstanding and you got them up to, I think, two litres. Uh, and these things were flying machines. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. There we are. Hello from Inverness. We love you in Inverness from Snakey. What a fantastic way that you'll speak up there. I've got some uh, new car art about to hit FB Charles. Excellent. Are you following McClue on there big time? Guys, get following as soon as you go on. Up to three litres. They did a three litre Capri. What was that one called? Remind me. Have you ever visited Hall Kirk? I haven't, Lewis. I've not actually been that far north. Otherwise, I would have done. Hello, Scotty, from the Punjab. Ah, the Punjab. We love the Punjab. It's such a shame it got split in two at partition. Big up the stone away black pudding. Ah, Davard. The black pudding is fantastic. I like the black pudding. Hi, Scotty. I hope you're well. Aidan, lovely to have you with us. And a big dinky do. We're just doing a quick pop-up. Will not be long, but I wanted to say hi to every single one of you. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. There's lots and lots of new TikTok videos for you. So get right into them. Can somebody tell me... Can you actually see the TikTok videos as soon as you come on? Hi, mate. This sounds like a good live. Mossy, we only do the very best lives. This is TikTok's top talk show. There we go. 
stayed in uh, Newton Street in Stornavay. Stornavay. Ah, yes, indeed. Uh, did you go to the Nicholson? Uh, fantastic. The Mark III was a three-liter Essex, a V6. That would be a flying machine. Now you are talking. Uh, hi, Scotty. How are you? Happy New Year. Absolutely, Chas. And we've done the Hogmanay show, so you'll get it on the YouTube channel. Can I have a shout out for Lloyd and John? They love darts and flat caps. I can't think of anything better for them, James. Can you still get kippers from Stornoway? The great place to get kippers was Ardrishig in Argyle. There you are. Forsyth Hamilton's kippers were probably the best in the world. So there you are. Fantastic. Yes. And the, the Argyle kippers. Tremendous stuff. Does anyone remember the Scottish TV show Monarch of the Glen? Well, it was. I don't think that was Scottish TV. Was that the BBC from the early 2000s? Was that the one that had uh, Richard Briers in it? And originally, I think, Ian Carmichael. Is that right, guys? There we are. You can tell me about that. Dinky do. Newry Kippers were better. Ah, Newry in the north of Ireland there. Uh, I'll try and visit them when I visit Achnamara in the summer. I don't know what's, uh, what's happening, uh, you know, because uh, Forsyth's no longer with us. But what a tremendous character he was, Forsyth Hamilton. There we are. Uh, so Achnamara, how beautiful is Achnamara? I'm just in love with it as you're talking. Scotty, uh, I don't know what that is, Davard. So there you are. You've got me there. Thoughts on Ned's? We could well do without them. But the example we're being shown from government at the moment. So, the Scotty, your friend Long John here. I hope you're keeping well. Lovely days. Yes, you know Newry in Northern Ireland. What a great place. Of course I know Newry. Newry Cathedral. Fantastic part of the world. You can't get more Scottish program than still game. Yes, absolutely. Missed you, big handsome. Thank you, Susie Babe. How lovely to have you with us and a big dinky do. We're only up for a few minutes. So there we go. My mother has fond memories of Stornoway kippers during the war because they were off ration. Aha, Aidan, your mother was up in Stornoway. Was she, um, did you tell me she was with the Wrens or something like that? They're all Navy. All right, Aldrin, how are you doing, Mr. Solo? Or can I call you Napoleon? Lovely to have you with us and a huge dinky do from me, Scotty McClue. Fantastic. As I say, it's just a random Monday night pop up to say hi. But I want every single one of you to follow me, please. Thank you. Dicky, Dicky McGee. How lovely to have you with us and dinky do. Dicky, have you followed us? Get everybody following. So there we go. Follow us as soon as you can. Is it easy to do, Decky? Do you have to click the top left plus sign? Or is there a wee sign that says follow? Uh, hiya, lad. I really like a girl. She's important to me, but I'm scared of what she'll say. Ask her. And then you'll find out what she'll say. I tell you, that's your best thing. Nothing wrong with being an Ed. I used to be one. Now I'm an electrical engineer. Um, no, I don't think it stands for National Electricity Dynamos. My grandfather was RAF adjutant. Mum stayed in England, but he brought them back on leave. Ah, yes, he brought back the kippers for their breakfast. My father taught me how to um, bone the kipper, lift the whole skeleton out. Uh, Scotty, uh, John O'Carroll will have to ban you for life for trying to be clever when you're not. Poor John. Say bye-bye to John, guys. Dafty. There he goes. Are we doing this one, eh? Fantastic. Now, now what have you got? Um, James Becks, dinky-doo. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. We love Liverpool. I used to broadcast to Liverpool. And the Liverpool people loved the bones of me. Late night radio on Radio City. How fantastic's that? Hey, Scotty. Fantastic. We loved it. Tremendous stuff. Hola, guy. Hola. Evening, sir. Very late tonight. Kalilio. Uh, I thought we'd just pop up and say hi because uh, see who's about. You know, I've done the mini Spitfire, the uh, 
the mini, ah, wait a minute, Charles tells me, this is Cars Guys, Charles says, I've done the Mini, the Spitfire, the Toledo. So that's Triumph you're into there. The Herald, the Dolomite, the Hunter, the Marina, the Coupe, the Stag, and the Morris 1000. So Charles, I take it you were close to a Triumph agent at the time. These Dolomites could shift. My friend had, I think, an 1800 and gave me a shot of that. Scotty, do you think Johnson has escaped the current mess? Well, he's very non-stick, our dear Prime Minister, you know. And he's held a lot of top jobs, but not for very long. And I think the Prime Minister one's one of the longer ones, is it not? Uh, but, uh, you know, I think he should probably go, but I think he will tough it out because that's in his character. And we'll see how he goes. I suppose a bright shell suit's the same as a high vis. Absolutely, a nice bright shell suit. You didn't need a high vis when you had your green shell suit in Liverpool. Dinky, do sir. The Toledo was my first car, age 17. Well, they did, I think they did Toledos from 1300. But this was a Dolomite 1850, I think. Would that be right? HL. What was HL? Reliant scimitars of the three liter four grenade engines, fiberglass bodies. Was that a Ford engine? All that I remember is that the scimitar could have an overheating challenge at times. I remember hearing about that, but they were fiberglass. Yes, the, the Reliance. And I remember the Reliant three wheeler like, uh, like Del Boy and Rodney's, the trotters. Uh, I've got 20 minutes of my birthday left, another year not to the post. Kulilo, happy birthday to you, my dear, dear fellow. Dinky do. Great car, the Rover SD1 V8. So there you are. Yes, the SD1 V8. Now, I had the 1800, uh, the SD1, and somebody told me to get the Vanden Pla 3.5 litre because they said um, it's more comfortable to sit in while well, you're waiting for roadside assistance. <laughs> Speak Spanish. Hola, me hablamo Scotty Marklu. Fantastic. I'm going to have to go soon, guys. I just thought it pop up. Reliant Scimitars are brilliant wee cars. Amazing. I agree with all you said, Reed Johnson. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. We need followers. Big style. Everybody with a TikTok account should be following Scotty McClue. There we are. That's what it's about. Hashtag float eye, first lord of the internet. Yes, indeedy. And there's beautiful videos for you. Get watching, liking, and sharing, please. Every single one of you should also subscribe to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel because at nine o'clock on a Saturday night, we do the internet phone in. And I don't want you missing out on that. Uh, I still think the best car ever was a 1969 Roadrunner. What was that, CBS? You've lost me there. I used to be in love with old Rover cars. I think we're talking the P4 and the P5 and the P6. Uh, just chose this lot as made a good set and have great memories of them playing around. At the Scrappies, I know what you mean. Well, I had a Morris Minor. We'd fought out £90 for it, so it wasn't cheap. And we only ran it for about maybe 10 years. Uh, what was the difference between the Dolomite and the Toledo? I think the Toledo was a smaller version of the Dolomite. I don't know that there was a great difference body-wise, but engine-wise and performance-wise, there certainly was. Because the Toledos did a 1300 and the Dolomites did an 1850 HL. What's HL, guys? Anybody know? I don't. Please, can you wish my friend Liam a happy birthday? There we are. He received a Bolton season ticket. Wow. There we are. They must be something of a rarity. There we are. Fantastic stuff. The Plymouth Roadrunner. So are you talking an American car here? I don't know much about American cars, but my friend had a Ford Thunderbird, 5.7 litre. And when you started it up, the um, headlamps uncovered. <laughs> the Rover P6 V8, brilliant machine. That V8 engine, I had it in Range Rovers 
It was a gorgeous, gorgeous engine, originally a Buick, and I think originally a cast iron engine, and then it became uh, an alloy. Uh, is that right? Uh, so there we are, the V8, beautiful. Yeah, sounded like a Spitfire starting up. American muscle car, the Roadrunner GT. Roadrunners were an American car. Aha, that's where you've lost me. I was never big on American cars because they had uh, primary safety, but not such good secondary safety. Was that right? Or secondary safety, but not such good primary safety. Yes, they sort of floated American cars. They still do. Uh, as I hear, what have we got here? Hang on. Second. As soon as I hear Tory. I think of you. Well, how very strange, Harry, because I'm totally apolitical. So there you are. So as soon as I hear Tory, I shall think of you. Fantastic. There we go. I shall think, Harry, Tories. Plymouth Roadrunners were American. My mate's first car was a Dolomite of his dad. It had an overdrive switch on the great stick. I think you mean the gear stick, Galeno. Yes, and so did, if I remember, Triumphs were quite big. The A lovely, lovely Triumph was the Mark I 2000, the Triumph 2000, uh, Mark I. And it was a four-speed, no power steering, if I remember, but it had overdrive. And you could flick this thing in and out of overdrive. It was effectively an early fifth gear. There we are. Dinky do every day. Take care. Be safe and well. The gear stick absolutely canadial. Guys, I'm going to have to dash soon. Hello from Hull. We love you. Don't forget the Ford Cortina. I love the Ford Cortina. The Mark 1, the Mark 2. I don't think there was a Mark 3. I think there was a Mark 2. Oh, yes, there was a Mark 3. What am I talking about? Uh, so the Mark 1 had the round back lights with a sort of Y on them. And the Mark II was the nice square shape. And the Mark III flowed. It had a flow about it. Get to bed, Scotty. I'm just on my way, Jason. I just thought I'd pop up and say hi, not to just one nation, but to all the nations on TikTok. Every single one of you should be following and have a look at the videos. So there we are. Big 687. We don't do opinions on individuals like that. Originally a Buick engine sold to British Leyland, a uh, Rover V8, plenty brilliant cars. Well, the V8 I first encountered in the uh, the big 3.5 litre P6, was it? Lovely big beast of a car. The government had them. And then Thatcher got rid of them because she thought people might see too much when she was getting out of them. I mean, for goodness sake, as if anybody was going to look. You know what I mean? So that was it. So she got rid of the government rovers. We should still have them. That would be because it added a bit of class to Britain. Joe Miller, thank you for my beautiful gifts there. All you TikTokers are very, very generous, I have to say. There we go. Always been a fan of the Ford Granada Mark I and Mark II. I'll tell you, I was in love with the two-liter Granada, the last one, the big square one, loved the Mark 1s as well because they had a console. With the Mark 1, you could get a console or a Granada. But I loved the Mark 2 Granada's automatic two-liter. Beautiful thing. Very, very smooth. That could get off its mark. Kirby the Annihilator, the man that's united more kingdoms than arranged marriages. Mr. McClue, how do you do, Kirby the Annihilator? What a joy and a privilege to have you with us, you top, top man. Fantastic. If you've just joined us, folks, a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, the first lord of the internet, hashtag Floati, the world's most famous man and the world's most humble man. And we like that. We're live on TikTok. I've uploaded lots of new TikTok videos. Can somebody answer the question? Can you see the TikTok videos as soon as you join us? Do let me know. It's very, very important. We never scroll. We never troll. Follow me as soon as you come on, please, guys. Hello from Toronto, Mac Moreau. We love you in Toronto. I worked for a company called Scottish Television, and it was owned by Lord Roy Thompson, who owned the Times in London. And I'm sure Lord Thompson was, he was a Canadian, and I'm sure he was from Toronto. 
So there you are, and had radio stations and maybe television stations in Toronto. Fort Capri was a weird drive, very weird bonnet, very long bonnet, yes. 50 centimetres of snow here today, says Mac Moreau in Toronto. We love it. You tell me about the pictures on your wall, if you don't mind, I don't mind at all. That's Lord Reith the Labrador's graduation, and I went along to hold the hood. And uh, isn't he beautiful? What a handsome dog. The other one was presented to me when Scotty McClough started on the radio. And the little one is Decoupage Thistle, made by a lovely, lovely lady called Bella from Bothwell. Uh, so that's the pictures on the wall. And the shield above of my old school. Uh, what about that, I ask you? Is that not amazing? Hello, everybody, Dinky Do. There we are. Sent CEOs. Oh, wow. Chief Executive Officers. My former Chief Executive Officer paid me a massive, massive compliment the other day. He said, Thank you, Scotty, for turning a £500,000 project into a £26 million success story. And you'll see his comment on the TikTok videos. Have a look, guys, because this is big. There we are. Thank you, Joe Miller, for my beautiful Chief Executive Officer gift. There we are. Buick Orientated in Canada, Scotty, the McLaughlin Buick Company. Well, of course, in the north of America, do you not have Detroit? And was Detroit not the home of Henry Ford and the Ford Motor Car? Oh, and I heard that Detroit was very sadly run down, but somebody said it's on the up again. We love that. Buicks, I remember I had a model called a Buick Riviera. Anybody heard of that one? Keep your hand on your hitney. Disco Den. What very, very sound advice. Yes, indeed. Keep your horn in your hitney. You little legend, Scotty. My granda had a Lada Riva. The Riva was a very nice car, actually. Very good. I had a dear old friend that spoke the very deep voice. He said, people talk about Lada cars. I've run Lada cars for seven years. Fantastic. There you are. Do you like Hondas? Yes, I do. Anything Japanese. Very light and reliable. Beautifully made. So there. Remember the Hondas when they came out? I can remember when Honda motorcycles came out because we had so many beautiful British motorcycles. And then the Hondas appeared and just kind of conquered the market because they were so light and fast. So a 125 Honda, I think, could probably show a clean pair of heels to a 250cc British motorcycle, that sort of thing. Maybe I'm talking nonsense. What car do you own at the moment, Scotty? I own two cars, Ferdy. One is uh, 30 years old. And the other is 22 years old, I think. Yes, 22 years old this year. My everyday driving is 22. And my luxury driving is 30. So there we are. So that's what we've got. Guys, has everybody followed me? Follow, follow. Scotty McClure, we're in the middle of a follow fest at the moment. I like your caravan. It looks suspicious. Thank you very much. Yes, it did. It's a tourer. I had the 2.8 gear Mark II. When you say gear, are you talking um, are you talking Capri or are you talking the Granada gear? They did a gear, didn't they, which was Ford sort of upmarket uh, bodies, yes. Are you Scottish? Do you know I am actually? Thank you. Uh, well, says Carla Man 56. Well, Carla Man 56, what are you like? Uh, I like your hat. Thank you very much for that, that gorilla. Uh, driving a 2022 Chev Suburban RS Tina. It's got a beautiful vehicle. Mac Moreau, very, very swish. There we are. Uh, and uh, virtually a brand new car. Well, it is a brand new car. Love the Tammy lad. Excellent. I thank you very much. Scotty McClue's bonnet. I'm famous for it. I've got five minutes to go, guys. Ford Capri is a great car to drive, just takes a bit of getting used to. Very different to most cars. Yes, indeed. How's the road holding? Because it was a rear wheeler, wasn't it? 
Uh, it's nice to see a Welshman on TikTok. Are you a Welshman desire? Well, I'll say to you, Yakida Nosda. There we are. We love having you on. We're fond of the Welsh on here. There we are. Bit of a break with tradition there, isn't there? Good evening to you, Scotty, from the Isle of Man. Ah, from Mona's Isle. Yes, indeed. Are you from Douglas, Peel, Onchen? There we are. Of course, I used to broadcast to the Isle of Man. We were the big uh, radio station getting listened from Red Rose in Lancashire. Yes, indeed. I remember during the TT. Hello from Ireland, Scotty. And of course, I loved the big turbine steamers that used to go from Liverpool out to the Isle of Man. Beautiful. The Manxman. The Mona's Isle, the Lady of Man. Beautiful, beautiful creatures. Built by Dennis and Dumbarton, a lot of them. My dad had a console, a great car, just three gears. Even when he had six gears in later life, he only used three. Now, Aidan, are you talking the Mark I console, which had a column change, and I think it was a three gears? And that was a brilliant, brilliant car. 1950s, maybe 1952, my friend had a 1952, and they were smooth and comfortable. The Mark I console. What engine was in the console? I think the Mark I might have been a 1200, because it would have been capturing the end of British austerity motoring. Britain seems to have been in austerity since the Second World War, except when we were in the EU. And these were the good times. Scotty, you're such an inspiration. Joe Miller, not at all. Thank you for your kindness and your beautiful gifts. You're an inspiration yourself. What have we got here? What's happening, says Wilson? Uh, we're happening, Wilson. Hashtag float eyes. Scotty McClue, live just for you. Guys, I've got 3,000 likes here. Have you been tap, 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 tap on your screens? There we are. Three more minutes and we're going to have to dash the Buick Riviera boat tail. Beautiful car. Well, I had the model of that. Reva made beautiful boats as well. Reva. Yes, the Reva boats. You used to see them. These beautiful motor boats on things like Lake Como and that sort of idea. Yes, the Reva. And the Andrews Slipper Launch. Beautiful. I remember going to Henley to a classic boat show and seeing Peter Freebody there. And Peter, I don't know that Peter's still with us, but Peter had these beautiful slipper launches that he had built. Fantastic. We love it. Yes, indeed. Charles, thank you for my beautiful red roses. Guys, have you all followed me? We need to get our followers on here. Very, very important. So there you are. Get following as soon as you can. Did you know that General Motors originated in Canada, Scotty? Colonel Aris McLaughlin founded it. I did know that, Mac Moreau, funnily enough. It's one of these facts that I picked up because uh, McClue loves information, education, and entertainment. I've got 4,000 likes. What are you guys like? Four, one. For two, my goodness me, what are you like, guys? Somebody's at the tap, 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 tap. There we are. If you've just joined us, please follow me. And a very, very, very warm welcome to Scotty McClue, TikTok's top talk show. Try saying that when you've had a refreshment. Uh, now, uh, washalom, because you're a troll, we count you as a troll for trying to get me to say that. So we're going to give you a lifetime ban. You'll never, ever, ever be back on Scotty McClue. Guys, can we say bye-bye to Washalam for trolling? Remember, nobody ever trolls Scotty McClue Washalam. There he goes. Bye-bye. That's him. Banned. Right. That's wonderful. Fantastic stuff. Now, I miss all the older models. Guys, never, ever, 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 ever troll Scotty McClure. It's a first rule of the internet. Never come on with trying to get me to say rude words or anything like that. It's just wholly and totally unacceptable. All right, have you got that? Good. Otherwise, we have to send you down the swanee and turn you into toast. And not everybody likes that. 
Guys, can you all follow me as soon as you come on? I've got 5,000 likes tonight. Thank you for that. And follow as soon as you come on. It's very much appreciated. So if you're watching Scotty McClue but you haven't followed, please follow now. Um, can you tell me? Somebody still hasn't told me. Can you see the videos when you come on? And also you can get access to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. You will see the link in my TikTok bio. So get on to that and get subscribing because on a Saturday night at 9 o'clock UK time, Greenwich Mean Time, five and a half thousand likes, by the way, guys. Greenwich Mean Time, 9 o'clock, Saturday night, Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. We do the internet phone in and it's massive. So get yourself into that. It's the biggest thing happening on the internet. It makes me feel old, says we scooter, we scooter. Never, ever, ever feel old watching Scotty McClure. German engineering is the best. Well, yes and no. I agree. I love the products of the Bavarian Mutterwerken and the products of Karl Benz. There you are. And, uh, and his daughter, Mercedes. There you are. Fantastic. But Daimler, which was originally a German uh, mark. And Daimler, of course, became the car. The royal family had Daimlers in this country. Oh, up until, I think they had Daimlers. They ran Daimlers. They've run Daimlers for a long time. There we are. Uh, we Scooter, what are you talking about? We don't go into that. Good evening, sir. Hope you're well. Andrea, how lovely to have you with us. And a massive dinky-doo to you. Of course, we're well. We're well for seeing everybody on here. Uh, right, Manny, you'll have to go down the Swanee for being a troll. Manny0744 has tried to get McClue to say something silly, so Manny does not belong on here. There you go, Manny. Bye-bye, Dafty. Bye-bye, Manny the Dafty. Manny is a Dafty, Dafty. There you go. Fantastic. That's Manny gone, guys. Uh, good evening, sir. Hope you're well. We just announced, poor Manny, because we'd actually just announced that you never, ever, ever troll Scotty McClue. Guys, these uh, TikTok videos are there for your edification, education, enjoyment, and delight. Get watching, get liking, and get sharing, because this is massive. Remember, I do the internet phone-in at 9 o'clock on a Saturday evening. Greenwich Mean Time. So get on to the Scotty McClure's YouTube channel and subscribe. Uh, pull the choke on that, Capri. It was a broad card. Do you remember the chokes? Fantastic. Who remembers the Fiesta? I remember the very first Fiestas. They were great little cars, Charles. Yes, all the Fords were always very, very reliable. Uh, I'd love to buy a Mark IV R32, such a beautiful car. What's that, uh, Cillian? You'll have to tell us. The man who founded Buick was from Scotland. Scotland has invented virtually everything that's useful in the world. There we go. That's just what we do. Scott, do you remember the big, the band Big Country? Yes, I do, Ferdy. I love them. Whoo! Just having a quick uh, comfort break. We call it a comfort break, but it's actually just a mop down with a, a damp cloth. Oh, how lovely to have you all with us. Dinky do, I say to you. Guys, has everybody followed? Please follow on the TikTok as soon as you can. Obviously, the trolls aren't going to follow, but we don't want them anyway. Scotty McClure, do you remember me? Westworld, of course I remember you. OMG, Scotty McClure says carpet. Carpet dinky do. It is indeed Scotty McClure saying hi to every single one of you. How good is that? Lovely, lovely. There we are. The Buick was a McLaughlin vehicle. Colonel Harris McLaughlin from Ontario in Canada. Mac Moreau, you're a brilliant source of information. We love it. So there you go. Thank you for that. We had a Triumph Spitfire and a Stag. The Stag was a beautiful car. The design was fantastic. I think, did the Stag have uh, head problems laterally, though? The Triumph Dolomite. Gorgeous cars. As I say, this 1850 was a flying machine. You remind me of Harry Seacombe. Haggis, I can't believe you've said that. 
Now, I could never see it, but an old friend of mine said, you are a dead ringer for Harry Seacombe. If they ever do a, a, a Life of Harry Seacombe, a film with Harry Seacombe, you will play that part. You should play that part. And I couldn't see it myself. And then I have a book by Harry Seacombe. I think it'll be his autobiography. And uh, there's a picture in the back and it, it, it is me. It's a dead rigger for me. Incredible. So there you are. But that's very interesting, Haggis. Best days ever. Carpet stay, absolutely. Hello, mate, from Iceland. We love you in Iceland, Ad Skilsian. Hello from Cornwall. I love Cornwall. I remember living in Helston. Oh, and we, the food, the food, huge bowl of soup. Then uh, the beef, the bread sauce, the sprouts, the potatoes, the turnips, then the pudding. Oh, fantastic. I shall tell you. There we are, Marvin. Dinky, do. How lovely to have you with us. We love Cornwall. How are you doing, Scotty? Looking good. Hope you're well, Olgen. I am indeed Granville. And better for seeing you, Granville, my dear friend. How lovely to have you with us. And a massive dinky do. Dinky do, Scotty McClure. Do you remember me? Of course we do, West World. There we are. Now, what we got there, what I loved about Cornwall, they go morning at about three o'clock in the afternoon, morning. And then uh, afternoon is during the night. Whoa, it's, it's, I swear to a pig this afternoon. I had chicken soup for my dinner. There we are. What about the Defender 90, the pickup one, Scotty? An excellent machine, Celine. Yes, indeed. The only reason I didn't go for the Defender is I didn't feel very comfortable resting my elbow on, uh, on with the window down, you know what I mean? Uh, follow us as soon as you can, guys. Do you have a tattoo? No. And uh, when I was brought up, you kind of, unless it was somebody who was maybe a master mariner or something like that, or seagoing, you didn't really trust people with tattoos, but now everybody's got one. So I suppose it's like a baseball cap. You didn't used to trust anybody wearing a baseball cap, but now you get like uh, massive... Um, Wealthy people with baseball caps on, you know what I'm saying? Very, very strange. 6,000 likes, guys. So lovely to have you with us. Can everybody watching follow, please, as soon as you can? Do it right now and get on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. So complicated, it's called Scotty McClue, the internet phone in. Because at 9 o'clock on a Saturday night, we do the internet phone in. So get organized for that, guys, as soon as you can. Dinky do, hope you're well, my friend. Dinky do from Lark Hall, the longest main street in the world. Why would anybody even think about trolling Scotty? Wonky, lovely to have you with us. They're just daft, just a very low intelligence, as trolls are. They're just poor wee souls that can't hold a conversation. They've stumbled upon TikTok's top talk show, and they think, what do I do here? So they just say something silly. Hoping I'll say something silly. Fat chance. 40 years in television and radio. As if I'm going to do that. Fluffy slippers. Love ya. Sharon Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Um, in Yuri, have you heard of Derry Big? There we are. Well, I'll not go into all sorts of bits and pieces of what I've heard and what I haven't heard. Do you know what I'm saying to you? Like, so there we are. Dinky do from Lark Hall. But we love Yuri. There we are. Do you have it? No, I don't have it. To. Thank you for sending me all these likes. 2K. We're just coming up to 6,000 likes, guys. How big is this? Massive, massive, massive. Really, can anybody remember when I came on? Uh, why try trolling someone with your experience? That's just ignorance. That's ignorance. It is ignorance, Aiden. That's what trolls are. They are ignorant. They are the antithesis of your good self. There's a beautiful word for this time of night, guys. The antithesis. Yes, your videos appear here on TikTok. So, Kalelio, as soon as you come on to TikTok, can you see the videos? 
because I've uploaded them for the TikTokers to enjoy. Edification, education, enjoyment, and delight. There we are. That's what it's all about. Dinky Doo from Lark Hall. I remember the 103 days. Ah, Kevin. Uh, you're on late. I'm just going to bed. Angela, I'm just going to bed myself. But I wanted to pop up and speak to not just one nation, but all the nations of the world on TikTok Live. I think that's very, very important. Très important. Um, I was joking, Scotty, good lad, six years sober, doing the swanee for the dunderhead. Absolutely. Only a full troll, Scotty. VW Golf 3.2 V6 R32. Wow. Wow. A V6 3.2 Golf. That's virtually a spacecraft, I would have thought. Woo! 6,000 likes, guys. Scotland rules. Good night, Scotty McClure. Dinky doo. Good night, Angela. Sleep well, my dear. VW Mark 4 R32. Thank you, Cillian. Uh, there we go. Dinky doo, my sister. Uh, right, Glockeroni. Glockeroni down the swanee, guys, for being an idiot. Bye bye, Glockeroni. I'm glad I'm not as stupid as you. There he goes. Fantastic. Right. Now, uh, Scotty, have you been? Dinky doo de tan. Fall as soon as you can. There we are. Uh, Glockeroni. No, Glockeroni's gone, Eden. He can't hear you now. He's toast. He's a wadun the swanee with the rest of the idiots. It's funny because he should just have heard us talking that we don't do any trolling on here. Scotty, opinions on the clowns in Parliament. Is it time for Scotland to break through the Union? Detan, Scotland should never have gone into the Union in 1707. It was jiggery pokery. And it was actually jiggery pokery by a Stuart Queen, Queen Anne. She was buying a lot of the jiggery pokery and it was caused by um, William, uh, William of Orange, in the early days, pulling out of the Darien scheme. He was a baddie as well. It's a shame, but there you are. So, uh, no, I'm very, very unimpressed with what's going on in Parliament, I can tell you. Cornwall's where it's at. I live here. I wonder if Harry Seacom had people saying dinky do to him. Well, I remember... Uh, a lot of my colleagues in ITV worked closely with Harry on the Highway series, and he was just such a lovely, lovely man. Harry Seacombe, there you go. So there we are. And I love, I still love Harry Seacombe singing. The Ton are rising, Scotty. Mon the Ton big. Good evening, Scotty. Good evening, Dinky Doo. So lovely to have you with us. Can anybody remember when I came on, guys? What team do you support? I don't support any financially now. I don't have the wherewithal. There we are. What's your favorite big country song? Guys, see if you're on here. Have you followed me? Please get following as soon as you come on. We're in the middle of a follow fest. And it'd be great to have you on big style. Right, Scotty. Hello, Joey711. Great to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome. Uh, internet and cybersecurity, absolutely, Joey. That's what it's all about. Followers, as soon as you come on, guys, thank you. Any more followers? They're expensive. They sell in Ireland for nearly 20K. What the, uh, the cars? Uh, followers, as soon as you come on, right. A really funny thing here, says Joey. Sold out for 20 pieces of silver, mate. We were, Andrew. The Siller. Do you know that Scotland was bought out for, I worked it out. It was probably about 250 quid or something. You know, it wasn't very much. Some of the big wigs got 100, others got 25. Uh, and uh, and I think I think one got a fiver. But, uh, but the, also there was something, some huge amount went missing. 36,000 quid or something. Very, very strange. Free Northern Ireland, it's as free as a butt, has been for almost 100 years. Greetings from Long Island. Thank you, Ed, from Long Island. How are you? I love you, Ed. You don't get many things right, but I do love you. They are just telling you, just letting you know, my boy. Went to Edinburgh Zoo, loved it and loved Scotland. Came from the northeast. How fantastic is that? Dinky do, I say. Guys, can anybody remember when I came on? 
Uh, how come you don't wear glasses anymore? Well, it's very strange. I do for driving, but as I've got older, I have to take my glasses off to see. And I can't hear a thing without them. What about that? There you go. Went to Edinburgh Zoo. So there you go. And from the northeast, the penguins. Snowing on Long Island. Ah, Ed. Yes, you've got the snow. My goodness me. Guys, I'm going to have to push off. It's been a real blast tonight. What a joy. You people are beautiful. Good evening from Washington. Oh, so sorry. I beg your pardon. It's Larry. I misread that, Larry. Good evening from Wilmington in North Carolina. We love you in North Carolina. Somebody told me, go to America, Scotty. Do your television and radio stuff and go to the Carolinas. There you are. He said, they will love you. Where is Scotland? Are you from the West Coast? The best show, says Joey. God bless Scotty. Two feet of snow just outside of Buffalo in New York. Wow, Drewski. What a man you are, dinky-doo. What about where you are, Drewski? There we are. Uh, wonderful stuff. Now, uh, who else have we got? Uh, Grintz is on, just joining us from America. Everybody's on from America. You ever been to the USA? No. That's a luxury I've been denied in my life. I'd love to come. I need a very wealthy sponsor. I had my old boss the other day said, thank you, Scotty, for turning a half million pound project into a 26 million pound success story. So there's a saying in the media, whoever has McClue has the market. And it's as true today as it ever was. What about that? Hello from Aberdeen, Scotty. I think they do for Aberdeen fit like. We'd love to have you here, Larry. You'd get me on the radio at nights, argy barging with the people. I'm an hour from Buffalo. I have two feet just on the Canadian side of the border. Absolutely, Drewski. Amazing. Top man. We love it. I hope, I hope you're all health, wealth. Scotty, dinky do, thank you. I'm from Glasgow on the coast of Clyde, says Andrew. Andrew, dinky do, you look like you'd be good at rugby. I used to play tight head prop down first. Boom! Get in there. Fantastic. Most companies don't have a McClure. I hope you have all the wealth. Well, no, I've climbed somebody else's ladder and they've got the money, but it's not a problem. No bad, Scotty, fat like yourself, Scottish loon, just... Chaffin' a wah, chaffin' a wah. Guys, I'm going to have to push off. I love you all to bits. Fantastic. Have a look at every single TikTok video. Like them and share them. Follow me as soon as you come on and subscribe to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. Scotty McClue, the internet phone in. Join us on Saturday nights at 9 o'clock. We'll have a live pop-up again as soon as possible to every single one of you. Good night. God bless. Dinky do. And taralas. Love to the United States of America as well as everywhere else in the beautiful world. See you guys. Take great care of yourselves and stay fabulous.